Have you ever imagined turning a waste product into a valued commodity? A commodity that you can resell again without any costly budget, like used items turned into beautiful house decorations. We visited Utawala Estate in Nairobi County where I met Mr. Karuku, a young entrepreneur who has turned waste products into a jewel that earns him a living. Plastic materials which most people tend to have no use of them after unpacking the goods in them are the same products that Mr. Karuku has turned into gold. The graduate in electrical engineering narrates to us how he first turned his career path into recycling of waste material. Oh, mimi nafanyanga recycling ya waste. Na bado nafanyanga stima. Mwenye nilimaliza nga college, nikisomia stima. Nilitoka nje kukakua kumekauka kidogo. Sa then nikatoka hivyo nje na unakuna waste mingi. So nikaona idea mwenye naza i-convert make money. With the plastics and other used items that he picks for recycling, Karuku developed ideas of making more income from the waste products by artistically creating flowers and other useful items for house decorations through the plastics. But why the interest in flowers? Before I was using my plastic, I was using my plastic. I was using my plastic. I was using my plastic. Sampo ya nyumba sasa. Sasa nikaona kuna venye aziendi sana. So venye nikuwa natembea watu wanakabiliza. Bada utengenezi tu nyumba. Siku tengeneze maua juu kila mtu wanataka. Kila mse utaka nyumba yaki ikuwa smart. So like idea yangu likuja. Demand ya watu. Walikuwa namambia maua kila mtu watanunua. Great opportunities don't come every day. You need to recognize and seize them with every chance you get. So that they keep attracting more and more. For Mr. Karuku, recognized the opportunities in plastics and decided to take the advantage of the market. Marketing is not good, but it was very poor. Adil was in almost one week, but it was not good, but it was not good, it was not good. But just how does he manage to get all these plastics for his work? Karuku has gained his outside links that he approved to be reliable in sourcing him the products. However, the products come as per the demanding of finished products in the market. I can see out as if I need to carry on. At all, I can consume no one. I can see me in Kenya. I'm a fanica. I go to I'm young. I'm paid. I go to the city. I'm a man of land. I'm a beast. I'm a guy. I'm a job. So I'm paying for no angle. Yes, I know. I collect within the area. I'm paying. I'm not buying. I'm not taking anything. I'm not. I'm not taking anything. I'm not taking anything. These are my plastic. Yeah, I'm lipa. The artist, my jewel, always he kuwa pekea koko yuanja. Musi uleta pa order. Yeah, niki tisho na msi flani kwa nyumba. Na mwambia na takaangu ni flani analeta. Na pia sometimes I ni hakuna order. Na mwa kutengeza samples mingi mingi. Karuku narrates to us how he first dared to start his business, with the fear of most educated youth today avoiding attachment. To small-scale jobs and waiting for white-collar jobs, Karuku chose to make himself his own boss with the cheapest of capital to start his business. Ni kakaunt capital kwanza ata unaweza shuka sana. Kwa sababu ni kianza ni lianzanga kitu ni litumia ni litumia tu rangi, rangi, brush na mafuta yata. Chupa zilikuwa tu kuna ageni walikuwa mepuja home. Sili na ngeli zaino walikuwa bayo maji na machupa. Sasa nikaamua venye nitaziri cycle hizo chupa zenyewe. Actually naweza sema ni kama nilianza na 150. But the benefits turn out to be encouraging. Benefits yangu ilikuwa obvious plastic ni kitu haitaisha. Then nataka ukipaka rangi itaka hapo forever. So ni kwa na avoid ile nataka ile design ukiuzia mtu forever nyumba imekaa smart. Hakuna like ati itaisha iharibike. Ya then hapo nje kuna miti tumeona miti ya machungwa hivyo. Sa hata nindi kushida ki mwagilia maji. Akisha inuwa iseto pale, forever itakapua. Ha benefits ikopua sana. Dile iku napata hutumido mingi kwa production. Jifregabu ukiangalia ikitu sinisima sana ya ceiling. Kama saa hii nika kuambia cost ni metumia hapo. Labda niseme hii kumiwa tui board. Then kuleto wa chupa hii ni chupa nguni ya moja. So ki estimate ni almost... Seme almost 1,000 di, ama less than, yeah. Nua venye natokia hivyo. 
then sauta uzia mtu kulingana na yeye in as much as the business is booming he tells us the challenges that the business has faced since its beginning and how he has managed to keep his customers hey challenges ni mingi unapata anga mse ame come anakuambia anataka maua fulani una design so obviously ndio wana mtu ako serious na mitisha anga deposit unaona sasa kuna wasingine umemitisha deposit akamwambia wewe hakuna shida wewe tengeneza ikiisha na kulipa zote so juu kuna vile utu utamwamini so naenda na natengeneza inaisha then anakuja akikam ana for example enda nayo then mnaanza kubishana yeah before kulipa yani mnangangana sana hadi zingine hadi kwenda tu hivyo inakuumiza lakini obvious kwa business lazima we expect loss yeah huwa nimezipangia kwa sababu zangu pia na kuanga na jua kuna vitu zingine zita happen and to the youth who feel solo and discouraged about what to do in life God aki create kila mse alikuanga na purpose yake. So like uwezi niambie purpose ya God ilikuwa tu kange chini umetulia tiju ujajiriwa. Hata mimi nimesoma na sijapata job, nikaamua kujiajiri. So kama hujapata job, ju job hatuwezi fit wote atuajiriwe. Fa tu kae chini, ufcreate tu yote kivi yako. Accorde maybe to your talent na interests, ukama up na kitu yako. Eventually saa pesa zita follow. Usifuate pesa kwanza kwa passion then pesa zitakaa Now here in Utawala Gizunguri business seems to be getting interesting on a daily basis the majority of Kenyans have underrated the power of plastic bottles but in Gizunguri Mr Karuki has taken advantage of bottles and making out a wonderful flowers and house decorations that earn him an income Timothy Zawadi till next time